Hello guys and welcome to Sackboy Modeling Part 2. In this tutorial we're going to be doing the body, the arms and the legs. So I'll go into your floor view. And remember we're going to be working in the front and the side, so we don't need the perspective. So get a cube, and bring it down here. There. We're going to scale it up to about here. Just move it in. Now we're going to need some edge loops because we need to form the body shape. So add one in about here. Add one here. Oh my god. Sorry, it's my computer. It's really lagging. I don't even know why. Right, so one here. And go to vertex and pull them out. Remember we want it just before the blue line starts and we're going to be moving it at the end of the blue line after, you'll see why, and down here, move these two back, okay, there, now we're going to be doing it in the front view as well, so these need to go here. Here. So now grab these ones and pull these out as well. Pull this one in. This one out. In, out, in, out. You shake it all about. Right, pull this one back in. Now go to face. Grab the bottom face. Click extrude. We want to pull it down. Then scale it in X. To about there. Scale it in Z just a bit to about there. Look in the side view for the Z scaling. Okay, so about there. G again. Scale it down. Then scale in X. Then scale in Z. Just have a quick look at perspective. It looks, looks alright. Go back to the front and side view. Now go to the top of our body and click extrude, pull it up and scale in X, then we need to reshape it in the side view, so pull it out to about there, pull this one here, we need some more edge loops here, right so one there, pull one up there, and pull this one out. This one out. Okay. Then go back to first, select the top first, and extrude again. Pull it up. Now we need to scale it in X. To about there. Go to vertex in side view. And move it to about there. And there. Now add an edge loop here and pull these vertexes out. And now reshape them in side view to about there and there. Okay, that's it for the body. And that's all we need to do. Now we're going to be doing the arms and the legs. Okay, right. First of all, I'm just going to say I cannot model hands, okay? So past the I will not be able to go on no more. You guys can try it if you want, but I've already tried and mine looked like Freddy Krueger's claws. So go to a cube, pull it down to about when it moves, pull it down to about here. Right. Okay. Right, okay. Um uh, well, uh, right, put about down here. 
put it down to about here and move it to about here in the side view now if you want you can rotate it okay like that but I wouldn't because it messes up the side view image so what I'd do is just move it in the side view first to about there and here pull them out and here as well then we want to pull these here okay match these up to about there then these ones go here and up here okay I wouldn't leave it like this because it looks a bit dodgy so you need some edge loops in here 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 and here let's go to vertex and drag these up drag this up as well and also try and get the shape so in the side view you want to grab this up here so you can move it in here so scaling Z then again here scaling Z okay you want to try to get the same thickness as you did the top part of it so move it up to about here and scale this move it as well scale this one move it here scale that as well move it move this, move that and scale again what you could do and it will be easier to do it as well is move these then grab them both and scale it so to about there then move them it's just easier that way because then like one part's not smaller than the other, or the other part's not bigger than the other. So we need one in about here and here. And just move this one down. Move this up. Move this up. This up. Come on. Grab them both. You want to scale them in with these two as well. Up here. You want to scale these in as well. And <coughs> yeah, that'll be all right. What you could do is you could grab these two well these four vertexes here and pull them in like that ok and that's it for his arm at the moment ok already it's taken us like 9 minutes to do the body and arm so we can't do the legs on this one so just grab this arm and then go to <coughs> then go to edit when it works duplicate special and then I think it's this minus one. Okay. And now all, all you have to do is just move it into position like that. And if you want, you could just move. Right, one minute. Vertexes. And just drag these two up. Just to. Uh, Make this shape here. Yep, that's right. And that's it for now. Thanks for watching.